battery operated candle. Um, you might recognize these, we decorate with them at Christmas. And full disclosure, I was going to do this with a flashlight, but as I was, you know, rehearsing this morning, I broke the flashlight. So um, this is what we're doing <laughs> instead. So a flashlight or a candle, what does, what does that do for us? What, what use do we have for it? It gives us light, helps us to see. And we might need that if, well, if the power goes out or trying to read something or it's dark for whatever reason. We need light to shine and to help us to be able to see. So these uh, candles operate by turning and then they turn on. But this one isn't turning on. Hmm. I wonder what's wrong with it. Claudia, brilliant. Let's see, maybe there's no batteries. Empty, there's no batteries. Thankfully, I have a couple of batteries here. So let's see what happens when we put the batteries in. It might be hard to see from where you're sitting, but there is a light shining now that we have those batteries in. And today we are talking about the importance of staying connected to God. These batteries are like staying connected to God. If we don't have our batteries, we can flip the switch, we can turn the top, we can do whatever we want to do. But we're not going to shine. We're not going to give light uh, if we are not connected to God. But when we have our batteries, when we stay connected to God, we are able to shine our light out into the world and to see better to help others see better, too. Some of the ways that we can stay connected to God, there's lots of different ways that we'll be talking about later in the sermon, but some of the ways we can stay connected to God, and I'll maybe uh, gear these towards our kids, is to, we can pray, we can, um, we can read our Bible. These are for people of all ages. Uh, we can do something kind for someone, that's a way of staying connected to God. Um, we can help out on a, a school uh, trip or something like that. I know one of our young folks uh, was selling Girl Scout cookies, and she told me that she was selling Girl Scout cookies. Part of the reason was to help people. So that's one of the ways that we can stay connected to God is to help people who need help. So... Remember that as we shine our light in the world, we need to stay connected to God uh, in order to be able to do that. <laughs> 